And from the Green to the Red Chambers, the Senate has condemned what it describes as the unlawful encroachment and arrest of Nigerians by the authorities of the Republic of Benin. The Upper Chamber has now directed four of its committees to work with the Ministries of Foreign Affairs and Justice, as well as the National Border Commission, to urgently check this. The Nigerian Senate has condemned what it describes as the unlawful encroachment and arrest of Nigerians by the authorities of the Republic of Benin. The upper chamber has therefore directed its committees on foreign affairs, judiciary, human rights and legal matters, and state and local governments to interface with the Federal Ministry of Foreign Affairs, the Federal Ministry of Justice and National Border Commission to urgently put in place the necessary mechanisms that will provide lasting solutions to this issue. The upper chamber's decision to intervene was reached amid its resolutions following a point of order raised by Senator Tolu Odebiye. Coming under Order 42 and 52 of the Senate rules, Odebiye recalled the numerous reports of alleged encroachment into Nigeria's territory by authorities of the Republic of Benin, which, according to him, has become increasingly disturbing. I'm calling on the federal government to immediately secure the release of Nigerian citizens currently languishing in detention in the Republic of Benin as a result of their resistance to the continued encroachment. Aware that the continuous unchecked egress and egress of persons at the different entry points and borders between Nigeria and the Republic of Benin, the country's closest neighbor, are likely the result of the porosity of our, of our country's borders. The Senate, in its resolutions, condemned any act of unlawful encroachment and unlawful arrest of Nigerians by the authorities of the Republic of Benin. We've been shouting, we'll continue to do that, about even the Tongiji Island, which is in Nigeria territory. As we speak today, except for what maybe the Nigerian government is doing now, Tongiji Island will go the way of Bakasi Island. Time and again, you will see them coming into the Nigerian territory to arrest Nigerians, and they will be taken to their country, and nothing will happen. Indeed, they will be released at their whims and caprices whenever they wish to. Every citizen of Nigeria must be treated with dignity and respect by any nation in this world. Nigeria is not a pushover. And Nigeria is not an ordinary country. The upper chamber, however, directed its committees on foreign affairs, judiciary, human rights and legal matters, and state and local governments to interface with the Federal Ministry of Foreign Affairs, the Federal Ministry of Justice and National Border Commission to urgently put in place the necessary mechanism that would provide lasting solutions to this issue. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.